I feel good when I'm going up against a stronger opponent, knowing that at least I put in the work to make myself better. Students that participate in our system and our training, what we've seen is, you know, students have improved tremendously. Whoever walks through the door, regardless of how, why, what sports you play, it doesn't matter to us. Um, we're going to get to know you a little bit, what sports you play and what's your background in training. Hi, my name is Zoe Zladek and I play volleyball and lacrosse. Uh, Steve Hall, class of 2023. I'm a junior and I play football and run track. The, the teams that have consistently worked with us, they have made comments on how well their players move compared to their opponents. And I think it's definitely helped me with movements that are specific to lacrosse so I can work on things that will really help me in the game specifically. Our football defensive lineman is not training the same way as our girls soccer midfielder. Everybody does the foundation and we can break off and do hundreds of different things with them based on that foundation. We don't do just like bodybuilder, moving and lifting. We incorporate like our different sports into it so it helps with like jumping, helps with change of direction, all those things. So you're getting stronger and bigger and also getting faster and more agile. We have a uh, force platform that we use that measures the force that's put into the ground. It breaks their jump down into three categories. And this is concrete data and it's trackable. Being able to give them an exact number of, hey, here's where you're at as a seventh grader. Here's the work you did. You look at where you're at as a freshman and we still haven't hit anywhere near your ceiling. And that should give us a pretty good idea of, one, is our program working? Two, is the kid working hard? And then where do we need to adjust and, and make modifications from there? A lot of our players, you know, they, when they come in the weight room, they do their workout and they see that their body's getting stronger. We do the tests on them. They see that they're getting faster. They're getting quicker and more agile. That just boosts their confidence when they step on the field. Once you get to a certain point, you get more explosive. You can just feel how much better you move and just like, you just feel stronger on the field. In order to improve performance on a field, you do have to challenge your body to move better. Just as important is the reduced risk for injury. I definitely feel myself able to move faster and not have to worry about getting injured as much. Anytime we have anyone go out with a season ending injury, you know, I take it personally because they've gone through a system at our school and we need to improve the system to reduce that risk for injury. Out of all of our fall sports, including tackle football, we only had a couple students really miss uh, any games. So you're prehabbing and not rehabbing. In addition to the physical aspect of going to the weight room, there's definitely a mental aspect. As a student at MICDS, your time is very limited. Time's precious for everyone on, on this campus. Now that I'm in season, I only go one or two times a week, and that's during the school day, like during my free period. Just having that opportunity to squeeze in their workout when they can, it's, it's huge for them. All the training that we do, yes, it does help performance, it helps reduce risk for injury, but equally important, it helps the brain learn better. You know, there's research that shows that exercise ties into learning. It's a major component in, in the brain and creating neural connections and increasing neural connections. So it gives the students a, a chance to get away from that hard focused learning, get their body moving a little bit, so that when they go back to class, their brain's gonna be more efficient for learning. Everybody's in there working together. Everybody's in there getting better together. That's the biggest thing. You with different people from different teams, you're all building like an MICS like athlete family. just a family environment in the way room.